What's going on YouTube? Centex Collector here with a new build, the 2021 Throne Goon D2. So as you know, some of these parts probably look familiar from my 2021 Haro Pistol. And we'll go over that real quick. But I wanted a bike that had disc brakes and I want to go with the black and yellow theme. So here we are, we'll run through it here real quick. See the Pittsburgh decals I had done from a guy on Facebook, Elvin. But the mags came off the pistol, 29 inch R4s with the 29 by 2.5 Maxxis grifters came off the pistol as well. The valves, dice valves, I'm gonna swap out some black ones I have on the way. You can see the color, they call it combat black, but it looks like it's really like a matte black with some, the forks are gloss black. And the throne, a little red in there because the original rims are camo with red throne hubs, which I'm selling separately because I don't need them. Yellow pedals came off the pistol. Uh, the yellow chain, KMC, came off the pistol. Went with some Odyssey crank arms. Let's try to remember which, oh, there we go. Yeah, the Caliber 175s, which I got from my local bike shop, Empire BMX. And then the Sprocket 36 I got at the LBS. It's a relic. And then got the chain tensioners, some box chain tensioners. And I got another box seat post clamp, just like I had on the pistol, but I just bought another one instead of swapping it out. Uh, seat post, I might go yellow, I'm not sure yet. The throne seat, that's stock. I haven't had a chance to ride, it keeps raining down here, so I've been riding the 26 inch. You see my Haro DMC. And got the yellow Pittsburgh stickers on both sides. And then the grips, these grips are great. These are ESI. They're not as thick as the ones I have on my mountain bike. My mountain bike, I have the Wolf Tooth, which are thicker, which if I can find them in yellow, I might get those, but these seem pretty good so far. Uh, so we got the fit yellow stem, which I swapped over from the pistol. And then this has a Tektro mechanical disc brake, which I'm going to swap out for hydro. And then for now, I put on, this was on my mountain bike. And I got new ones on the mountain bike. But this is the Shimano Level T for the front disc brake. And I have the Tektro Rotors 160 front and back. But eventually I'm gonna get a different Shimano Hydros. This is Hydro Dot Fluid, but I'm gonna get some Shimano front and rear Hydros to replace these. The bars came off the pistol, Haro Baselines. I wanna see these like a nine inch rise or kind of tall i might go down to eight inch but four piece bars are pretty hard to find i got these really cheap i think i pay like maybe 40 bucks for these i got lucky and now you can't even find those or much more or anything else for four piece Let's see what else did we do um, but that was the main reason i bought this bike because the disc brakes like i said it comes stock with the mechanical rear Tektro Aries 160s rotors. And then I threw the, we got the Pittsburgh sticker on this side. And then I put the 160 rotor up front and it had the mounts. Most bikes don't have the mount. You have to do some sort of like adapter. But that's got the mount and I, off Amazon, I got the other piece mount to put on for the caliper. But 
Yeah, so far I'm digging it. Got disc brakes. Not a real fan of these mechanical ones. But obviously the hydro, the front hydro works great. And I'm going to upgrade those to Shimano hydro for front and back. I really need to get this thing out. Like I said, it's been raining like crazy down here in Texas for some reason. It never rains this much for the summertime. Oh, it's got a front badge. It was red. I just plasti dipped it in black and threw some clear on to try to give it a glossy look. But I'm just ready to get this thing out and see how it actually rise compared to the pistol it's definitely a cruising bike being a 29er if you've ridden a 26 and a 29 definitely a uh big difference in riding 36 i'm not sure if i should have gone with the bigger sprocket see some guys running 39 or better uh, my 24 inch race bike i'm running 41 18 so oh yeah the free wheel has 17 tooth Free wheel on the back. I believe that should be the ACS pause. It's hard to find free wheels right now as well. But a friend of mine, Tony, has a white throne goon. I was really digging it. So saw this one on Dan's comp for a good price. And it was the last one, apparently. And just, like I said, put all the yellow parts. Try to get me a more yellow and black bike. than uh... What I had, so there's the race bike going to Wichita Falls this weekend. There's the 26 I was telling you guys about. There's the pistol, swapped back some stock parts to, to sell it. And then my 29er mountain bike, I do a lot of riding on. I've got I think over a thousand miles. But yeah, guys, I actually ride all my bikes. We just went out last night, raced at Pflugerville, Capital City BMX on 24 inch. But I have, I should have, I'm riding tonight, so I should have 1,500 miles. Right now I'm at like 1,485. But yeah, I actually ride my bikes, guys. So get out there and ride, put some miles in, have fun. But here it is, 2021 Throne Goon D2. It's the revamped Goon, basically, with the disc brake capabilities. Like I said, stock comes rear mechanical disc and then up front it's got the mounts you can add your own disc brake up front like comment subscribe let me know how you're feeling about the goon i'm ready to hop on this thing and get some miles in on it jj out